What is up, homies? Welcome back to another reaction from Heroes Reforged. We are reacting to the fourth episode of X-Men 97. This episode is called mm -hmm. Motendo slash Life Death Part 1. Interesting. I don't even want to... Well, we already know where we're going with this. Goddamn. Speculate. Yeah. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. It'll can be we, a really fun time. To, well, do, do the rest of the housekeeping, then we'll talk about how much we hate Motendo. Sure. Uh, if you want to see the uncut reactions for this entire season, plus if you want to see the five seasons of X-Men the Animated Series, check them out on our Patreon. We've got every single one of them. All 75, 76, however many there are check it out it was a really mm -hmm. really fun time also mm -hmm. check out the chickskins podcast live every week every wednesday sometimes we might put it up put it out on a monday you never know you gotta mm -hmm. pay attention you never know join the discord check out all the other stuff that we're doing uh go ahead what were you gonna say guys we fucking hate mojo <laughs> yeah we do yeah we do, Mo wow. the yeah, mojo we do. episodes of the original x-men series almost made me want to quit watching <laughs> the original series all together it was but, so 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 bad but guys 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 this is the first episode we're watching since we went to the x-men premiere fan event mm -hmm. and those three episodes so finally nobody blew. can complain that we watched the episodes already yeah. without we have them, not yeah. seen episode four yet we're about to watch <laughs> no. it for the first time those episodes no. blew our goddamn minds and not just mm -hmm. us. We were coming out the gate being like, this show's way better than the original show. This is one of the mm -hmm. best things Marvel Studios has produced in years. And everybody called us crazy. But validation is ours, baby, because the entire <laughs> internet was like, you're right. Holy shit, this show is amazing. So here's what I'm... Yeah. I totally get what you guys are talking about with this, with this, with the aversion we had to Mojo. But here's what I'm mm -hmm. actually super excited about because, like Augustine, I've also been re watching the first three episodes with my significant other over the past couple mm -hmm. weeks. We're here, I'm ready to go. If there's like any team of creatives who could potentially make Mojo, the Mojo verse, that whole storyline, like really great, mm -hmm. I mean, look at what they did. We were talking about, look at what they did with the character of Morph. Like, I yeah. liked mm -hmm. Morph. But I never yeah. loved Morph. And now Morph is yeah. like such a great character in this show. Oh, yeah. Look at oh, what yeah. they're doing with the characterization, the writing. Everybody's getting their time to shine. I'm hoping this is going to be, I think it's going to be a Jubilee episode. I didn't watch the clip, but I, there was a little clip that came out I today and yesterday. Clip. And it you watched so the clip. Dope. Like It looks so I'm, good. I'm excited. I'm excited. <laughs> Plus, not yeah. to mention, a yeah. little comic book spoiler, Life Death mm -hmm. is apparently mm -hmm. the name of the storyline that's the very famous story where Storm lost her powers and then had to deal with that. So, mm -hmm. like, yeah. that's another great thing that's happening in the show right now. I'm just so yeah. damn excited to watch this with you guys. It's going to be awesome. I'm pumped. I'm pumped. All right. Well, Adam, let's get to it. I, I will say one thing from the clip that I saw. If you are a fan of the arcade X-Men video mm -hmm. game that used to mm -hmm. be at pizza shops, this is the episode for you. <laughs> Shit. All right. Well, <laughs> shut the fuck up and let's go. <laughs> yeah. Let's go. Kind of down, Adam. All right. Here we go. In three, <sighs> two, one, go. You have it found a little extra? Yeah, take some cream with it. Aw, oh, thanks, oh Remy. God, this, sh this show is so sexual. It's three sugars. I'll take a cappuccino if you just take an orange. <laughs> <laughs> Luckily, I am giving them. <laughs> After breakfast, the ex. <laughs> sure, That's the youngest member deserves some jubilation on her 18th birthday. Hey, it's Rogue's. It's Jubilee's birthday. It's my birthday <laughs> too. Who's got two thumbs that blast fireworks and turns 18 today? <laughs> oh my God. How do you want to celebrate the big 18th, huh? Big shocker, I know, but let's go to the arcade. Uh huh. Here we go. Mm hmm. You would have <laughs> seen in a bar of childish make believe. Oh my god. <laughs> they aren't even here oh because god. they just had to go play mutant politics at the United Nations. Genosha entering the UN is a big deal. Yeah, it's a big deal, Jubilee. I'm the birthday big man. <laughs> you actually do play video games? The only uh. people who hate video games are bad at video games. True, true, true. <laughs> oh my god. That's true. That's true. Never even heard of him. Motendo. Oh, Motendo. God. Oh, oh no. Oh, God. No. Oh, oh, Lord. This is some Nightmare on Elm Street shit. No, yeah. no, no, no. Oh, in the eye? Get out, dude. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Dial up noise. Yeah. We're in the uh, Matrix. How long were we playing? I assume I won. Wait. Oh, Oof. sweet God. Oh, no. You know, it would be a lot easier if you just used your powers. What if there's cameras around? My parents could see me on TV. Mm. Come on, buddy. Oh, God. Everyone is focused on you? Yes. 
Yeah, you don't have much of a choice here. Either use them or don't. But yeah, you just if you don't, suck it up, buddy. Wait, Operator. It could be a trap. A phone booth trap? That'd be creative. Trinity, <laughs> I need a way out. Yeah. Yep. Clearly. <laughs> oh, it literally it was. Yeah. <laughs> oh my God. Oh, this is Genosha. But like way back when, Genosha? Yeah, this is like what it looked like in the in the first episode that it appeared. Uh oh. Uh oh. Duh, we are totally in a video game. Mm -hmm. We're what? Pay attention to the young lady. Oh Christ. Oh, I hate Mojo. I made the pivot to video games. The future oh. of mind numbery. You're not just. Oh no. Oh, oh lord. They are numero uno. Oh. First blockbuster release where every level <laughs> is based off your own memory. Oh, man. Oh, God. Gamer girl <laughs> in a gamer world. You connect with the youth. You're their point of view. I think that was a Dazzler reference. That's I'm great. Nintendo, that's Mo for Mojo in every home. On every world in every dimension. <laughs> Zapping up nom 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 energy from the brains of all who play. Sounds like the plot to Batman forever. <laughs> <laughs> this is the dream jubilee be young forever replay the golden hits no growing up think about it jubes 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 <laughs> oh lord oh lord <laughs> the, rise the rise of jubilee. Of jubilee rise of jubilee that's rad I just, I just <laughs> hope that they released a soundtrack to this show because so I want rad. this music Whoa! Ooh. Holy Ooh. Shit. There's our boy. What was that? Oh my god. Also, like, it's I would so play this game rad, if this was dude. a real game. <laughs> this I, this is better so cool. be a real game. Oh. How did you get my health back? <laughs> that wasn't me. Oh, was somebody helping them from behind the scenes? Was it Mojo? Oh. He's at it again. Spiral. Oh. Spiral! This is what you get when you kill Tex oh. for failing to kill oh. the boss! Guys, I'm pretty sure that's Abby. That's my girlfriend. <laughs> <laughs> pretty sure you're right! <laughs> that yep. is awesome, man. Oh my god, I'm so excited that she's in this. That's so cool. I uh, should probably find a way out of here. What's the rush? These levels are taking me back. She's not supposed to be enjoying this. Yeah, right? Yeah. Reality will smack you right in the face. Oh, uh-oh. Oh. Lord it's Almighty. Great... It's a great Yo, uh, Sunspot's story gotta arc. Use this. Oh, no. Oh. Boss battle time, baby! I am Magneto. Oh, my God. Wow. Yeah, Sunspot needs to step it up, my Typical Lord. Boss yeah. battle shenanigans. I just need to wait for it to cycle. Oh, well, at least she's good at understanding the mechanics of the game. <laughs> there you go. Ooh. Oh, good one. Great. That was cool. All right, Jubilee. Get some pizza to Roberto so he can heal. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You need a much less of pepperoni quickly. Is that yeah. <laughs> the health. Oh. Yep. That's oh, my health. God. Oh. Extra life. Oh, somebody's messing with it. I thought I told you to get rid of her! <sighs> <laughs> oh, I'd know that scoff anywhere. That's my girlfriend. Yeah, I was gonna say that. You hear that all the time, don't you? I hear that all the time. I'm annoying as hell, and I hear that exact scoff all oh the time. Oh my god. Oh, oh, what? whose claw is that? Oh, don't tell what me the it's the Shadow King. Oh no, this is this other player. I wonder if it's Longshot or Dazzler or, or who. No, that was like a claw. I hacked you out of the game server and into Mojo's broadcast servers to buy us some time. Oh. She's a plot twist. She's in league with Mojo. <laughs> Zip, Zip is a cost up. Oh. oh. Mm -hmm. Like I said. Is it Jubilee? Yeah. yeah. Who's been Back. stuck there for what? a while? Oh, I see. Now we need to move. That blobby tyrant fraud could download in here any second. I did not see that coming. Not at all. I got a few questions. Yeah. Yeah. Who the hell are you? Mojo needed beta testers, digital replicas of me. I'm the only mm. one left. I've played these levels inside and out. Oh, jeez. I figured out a glitch and hacked my way through here before deletion. 
figures my game has cheat codes. Very me. <laughs> <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> Super cute. <laughs> what do you say we destroy Mojo's game and get you two lovebirds out of here? I love that her earrings say Jubilee. Oh, there's the... Oh, God. There's the arcade. Oh, no. oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. Oh. Boss mode. <laughs> the harder they pop. Okay. Wow. Look at adult Jubilee. Oh, that's, that ain't the half of it. Just you wait. Oh, nice. Oh. This is wow. like almost okay. Tronish at this point. Yeah. yeah. I love it. Whoa. Whoa. Is that Sunspot? Oh, dang. Yes. Hold up, cowboy. Let's go. Stay over till the fat desperate sings. Oh, oh. God. Ultimate power. Yeah. <laughs> you nasty this is, oh. <laughs> this is sick, dude. This is very Tron. This might have canceled me today, but I swear I'll gut you in the reboot. Oh, wow. <laughs> Man, those visuals. Yeah, Whoa. these visuals Whoa. are incredible. Oh, no, the digital duplicate. Jubilee wins. Huh? <laughs> now Spiral's going to take what? over. Oh, Last God. Stuff. Oh, the Motendo burned. Talk about risk. Oh, make out oh, already. Oh, there oh. we go. Okay. There oh, yeah. Oh, all right. <laughs> Literal sparks, people. Sparks are, yeah. <laughs> Popping off. In that, in that, in that window, white. Love it. that's great. Meanwhile, with Storm. Oh, I like that. I see. So that I was like see. a little intro. Oh. That was like a little intro to the episode. Cool. It's like a, like a little half and half, you know. My papa's bison chili. Mm. It's a leaner cut. Gives room for the spices to do their magic. Great voice for Forge, too. Your mutant gifts have allowed you to fix yourself. It wasn't anything to fix. Just adapted and got a little creative. Look at that hair on both of them. Yeah, I know. <gasps> but is it a little... Oh, 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 oh. I was literally about to say this is all a little too happy. Last power differential clicked in my head when we were out riding. Like I said... Helps to get outside. No way. Whoa. Already? I'm like, this is too good to be true, but this show moves yeah. fast, dude. Like, yeah. yeah. Only 10 eps. And this is part one, so. Mm -hmm. Heed my command. True, true, true. Oh, it didn't work. Not yet. Oh, interesting. I am Storm, mistress of the mistress elements. Mistress of oh. the elements. <laughs> Move the desert sands. Oh. No. Not yet. Oh. Uh. Why is fixing me so important to you? Fair question. Mm. I didn't have the resources to build what I so easily saw in my mind. The defense department offered to help me as long as I helped them build some devices. Oh no. Oh. He neutralized dangerous mutants. He, he built, built it. He's trying thing. to make amends. This is yeah. great because she's falling for him. If I told you the truth in Dallas, you wouldn't have let me help you. So you lied. This is not a lie. Oh, jeez. I'll say it once, just once. Then you can go where you can stay, but I love you. Whoa. Damn. Okay. Let's you meant go. to make me a goddess. Instead, oh. you have fashioned a fool. Well, listen, in the last that. in the last show, she got married in 27 minutes, and I didn't believe that for yeah, a second. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> you remember that episode? So... <laughs> Oh, a nightmare, a nightmare. She's having a nightmare. This is okay. Oh, it's okay. Oh, God. Aurora! <gasps> I was just coming upstairs after you. What? How did I return here? She... Uh oh. Nope. Oh, oh, nope. Psych. I don't oh, know what's... No. Oh, no, Lord. What's going on? Oh, what no. is this? It's Polemicus. <laughs> it's Polemicus. <laughs> what is that? What the... That's oh. fucking terrible. Was that that owl? Yeah. Get out of my home, you damn demon! Oh. 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 You live disappointed, trapped here, haunted. Mm. Is this the Shadow King? Remember the Shadow <gasps> the King, King had a history of the storm? King. What? Don't do it. Don't. Don't do I'll, it. I'll, I'll, I'll end no! you. Oh, Son my of a God. Bitch. Oh, oh, my God. Oh, <laughs> 
way. Jesus. Yeah, Come no, on, I gotta wait man. It be only a half hour long. No. Oh, my God. No. I refuse to believe it. I'm going to click back and hopefully there's a, <laughs> another episode uh, waiting for us. Uh, well, oh, yeah, I guess that's why. I guess that's why. It's only yeah, 30 minutes yeah. and it's a part one, you mother. And really, it was like 15 minutes each. So True. it felt even shorter. Yeah. Yeah, that's yeah. a really interesting choice to put two it, episodes kind of in one. Oh, there you go. Abby Trot a spiral. Hey, Abby Trot a nice. spiral. Oh, cool. Hey. That's awesome. You need to have her How pop cool. in, in the next episode and just say hi. Hi. Hi, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> man, I'm so proud of her. I'm so happy for her, man. That's so yeah, cool. That's, awesome. I, that's I, great. She was she was so stoked to get that role and she was so excited about how potentially cool this show could be. And I don't think even she knew how good this was going to turn out because she came right, with us right, to that X Men right. fan event. I got to yeah. watch the th first three episodes with her sitting next to me. And like I said before, yeah. third episode with the Goblin Queen, she turns to me and she's like, I love this show because yeah. it's mm -hmm. so good. That's awesome, man. Yeah. Hopefully they bring Spiral back and Abby can do a bunch <laughs> more voices. It'd be great. Yep. Hell but yeah. Maybe. That's maybe. pretty great. Yeah. Pretty great. That but cool. no, that's exciting. 15 minutes per segment it, they were very tonally different but really really fun each so of them. different um, yeah yeah the stuff yeah is so very, compelling though i guess it's because we saw the first three episodes back to back that it felt like a mm -hmm. huge arc to watch yep. this as like a half hour thing it's not enough i need i need i, know. I need a two hour episode please <laughs> release like four episodes in one because it just yeah. it's not enough i need more i need more i think obviously getting storm to get her powers back was too good to be true as you were saying adam mm -hmm. and um and i really love the the kind of flex that they did in, in mojo world where they turned it into the like the whole inspiration was the x-men yeah, arcade cool. cabinet so mm -hmm. incredible so damn yep. cool like that yep. i don't know when the, the x-men cabinet came out but i know it was in pizza's pizza places as the show was coming out from what I remember. Mm -hmm. And so the two probably didn't influence each other in any way, shape or form. Uh, but now they're both like so, so critical to X-Men culture, like so critical to yeah. like your knowledge of X-Men. Like you either watch the show or you played the game or you did both and you're a huge X-Men geek like we are. And uh, to see that in one show, it's really freaking rad. I, Looks like it did I come out like in 1992, a, around the same time as the yeah. game. The the cabinet. I, okay. Mm -hmm. And and I hope that there's a follow up to this because as cool as it was to have it be just a jubilee centric story where like she needed to learn a lesson and kind of grow as a character, I'd love to see the mm -hmm. rest of the X Men get back into that video game style or like another yeah. variation of the Mojo because that was that was what was really fun about those original episodes was that it was mm -hmm. a bunch of different genres that Mojo was like plopping the X-Men in TV wise. So if they're not doing video games in a follow up, what else could they are they going to do like movie genres? Are they going to I would just love to see the rest of this cast, the rest of these characters, like do a really slick new Mojo episode. Yeah, I don't want to see Spiral yeah. again, but basically I hope that they get to revisit <laughs> well, it. I think it'd be awesome. I mean, did you see the last shot of Spiral? She pushed Mojo's I know, she head like into took the over. machine and she had a little smirk on her. So I yeah, know. I have a feeling this is not the last time we're going to see Spiral at all. Yeah. I also do love how this show and these creators are obviously so aware of like the love hate relationship that we have with Mojo yeah. <laughs> to know oh just God. the right yeah. amount of Mojo to put in the show and yep. to feature yeah. the yep. character. I'm like, yeah. that was, that was just like, that was the perfect amount for me. Any like literally mm -hmm. five seconds more and I would have wanted to rip <laughs> my eyes out. That was just the perfect <laughs> amount for me. Yeah. Yeah. But high yeah, stakes, like, Great animation, yeah. you know, fun video yeah. game stuff. Yeah, that was fun. Mm -hmm. But the, will, the storm stuff say, was like, it hit real hard. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the storm stuff hit really, really well. And uh, like I said, I'm glad they didn't just like give her her powers within the next 15 mm -hmm. minutes. Um, I think my favorite part of this episode, though, was old Jubilee or older Jubilee showing yeah. off her, her powers because we see Jubilee's yep. powers and she just kind of blasts things with her hands. Right. And mm -hmm. it's not. It's not really refined. It's just her kind of blasting things. And to see her like skating around and creating these discs and chopping things yeah. <laughs> and like really being agile and being very powerful and, and you know, not one to be trifled with. Yep. Mm -hmm. uh, I yep. think it's really cool to see a Jubilee do that and, and have her see her own potential 
in something like that. I think that's really, really rad. I want to see yeah, Jubilee hope- really mature with her powers. Absolutely. Hopefully that's what that means. In the same way that like mm-hmm. episode one, we saw Cyclops do shit with his powers that the old show never even came close yeah. to, <laughs> you know, yeah. as he should, because he's this experienced field leader of this team. Mm-hmm. Jubilee's now 18 years old. She's been on the show, I think, in this world since she was 16. Wasn't she supposed to be 16 with like the first episode, Night of the Sentinels? Well, part I, one of I, two? Was, I was actually I was actually I thinking think. about that. And I was wondering, like, maybe the continuity in the show itself doesn't necessarily follow like I I, because the way I thought it was like yeah 92 Mm -hmm. 93 94 95 96 so then I was like okay well then how old was she in that first season like 13 I don't know right maybe maybe she could have been 13 too either way she was a she was a teenager and now she's still a teenager but like is is excited about this milestone age Mm -hmm. that we all get to what does that mean for her Mm -hmm. character her mm-hmm. personality, values, and perspective, and then her powers too. Let's upgrade yeah. those yeah. powers, dude. Yeah. This is a little bit yep. more Sunspot. I'm like, I can't wait for, you know, that's going to be a big moment where Sunspot like joins. Power. I know, yeah. like goes full yeah. Sunspot. It's going to be a big deal. Decide, yeah. You know, and says like mutant and proud. And like, he's been a really interesting character for them to shift from that new naive character or Mm self-absorbed character that was kind of Jubilee to now it's Roberto da Costa and Mm -hmm. he's rich and he has that perspective of like, it's been, it's been really interesting to have him be the guy. So yeah. I'm looking forward to seeing, you know, and then Gambit was so mad at Magneto today, dude. That's going to be <laughs> spicy when they throw down. That's going to be good, Oh, man. yeah. When they uh, drop the niceties beignets. and they, uh, mm-hmm. yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> yep, absolutely. Uh, I love X-Men 92, and I know we've talked about this like in every video, but it's so cool to to watch this and to see how the creators of X-Men 97 went through and pulled some of the best elements of it and are remixing mm-hmm. it or retell or not mm-hmm. retelling but like telling these stories that are obviously from the comic books but also just like falling in love with the characters all over again and they did yeah, it yeah, literally absolutely. in one episode with the premiere mm-hmm. and they're just continuing to build that and build out the arcs of the characters and they're gonna be these i i feel like they could be these moments where we're gonna kind of like live with certain characters for one episode or uh, yes. half an episode or whatever and yes. then we're gonna yeah. build up to whatever the finale is um, yeah. So I think that's going to be really fun to see how we're focusing on every character and what what moments we're going to focus on or what important moments that are going to really change or inspire or influence like what the character arcs are going to be is going to be really interesting to see mm-hmm. and then where it leaves it eventually for the last, you know, two, three episodes will be really yeah. cool. So, um, yeah, I mean, don't forget wait. this is part one. So yeah, the, we're going to see, we're going to see more of whatever's going on here. Absolutely. Hector, do you know anything about the adver- adversary about this demon? <sighs> Dude, I was thing about going to, on? I was about to pull up a new tab and start researching, but like, I don't <laughs> want to, like, I want yeah. the show okay. to, okay. I'll do the research. I'll do the deep dive after this whole season. I, yeah. I love so far which villains this show has decided to focus on and mm-hmm. to bring back. And, you know, we got a little taste of Sinister in the last episode, but I think he's still a major player. Mm-hmm. And oh, in episode two with Executioner, like, even though he's just like a goofy, goof ass, white supremacist, you know, uh, human supremacist <laughs> character, like, he yeah. he's the one who took Storm's powers away. And first mm-hmm. episode, Bolivar Trask, we've seen him before, but I'm excited to see the promise that has been given where it's like this these creators are gonna are going to go a little bit further in X-Men comics lore, maybe into the early two thousands, maybe beyond right, that. Right, right. Pull right. certain ideas and stuff and like bring up some more lesser known villains. We love our magnetos, we love our juggernauts. We love our mystiques, but like the adversary could be built up in a way that the Shadow King was when we watched mm-hmm, the original right, show. And like, right, exactly. They're so impactful in the comics. So I don't, I, I feel like I'm like, that makes me think of something, but I don't know if it's an 80s thing or a 90s thing or a 2000s mm-hmm, thing. Mm-hmm, and I'm mm-hmm. just going to leave it. I don't want to research it. I want to yeah. see what the hell that surprised. demon, right. owl. Yeah. Yeah. Let's be surprised. Let's, but then later yeah, I'll, yeah, I'll, I'll sure. look all that stuff up. So. <laughs> yeah. Agreed. Yeah. Agreed. Uh, but of course, <sighs> let us know your thoughts in the comments below. What did you think about this episode? This nice little two-parter two for one special let us know all your thoughts check out the Mm -hmm. reactions on patreon and we'll see you guys next week bye